Ratty Rats, written by Ned Chanson, illustrated by Paula Stricker. It was night and the crescent moon shone brightly. The ship was fully loaded and ready to sail. The rest gathered at the dock. They wanted to leave the busy, noisy city. They wanted to sail away to another land. One by one, the rest kneeled upon the ship. They crept up the wooden gangway. Then they slid down the rope and into the cargo bay. The cargo bay was dark. It was full of cargo. There was spice and rice, and there was floor and silk. The rats got comfortable in a dark cargo bay. They knew it would be a long trip. They needed a good hiding place where they could, could not be seen during the entire voyage. Many days passed at sea. The rats loved being at sea. They had plenty to eat, and no one saw them. But then the cook began to find evidence of rats. There were red holes killed in the sacks of rice, and something had nibbling the cheese. Oh no, cried the cook, it's the ready rats. They are on the ship, and they are eating our food. Set traps and catch the rats, said the captain. I will have no ready rats upon my ship. The sailor set traps and loaded them with bacon and cheese. But the rats were much too smart to get trapped. They tripped the traps and ate the bacon and cheese. Next, the sailors went to hoist the sails. Oh no, more evidence, said the first mate. The ratty rats have chewed holes in the sails. Seal the sails and bake more traps, said the captain. I will have no ready rats on my ship. But once again, the rats tripped the traps and ate the bait. Next, a terrible storm blew up. The ship was tossed around right in the rough waves. The captain sailed the ship into a quiet bay, and he ordered the sailors to rob the anchor. Oh no, still more evidence, cried the anchor man. The ratty rats have chewed through the anchor rope. That's it, screamed the captain. I have had enough. The captain lowered the lifeboat. He climbed into the lifeboat and paddled to shore. Burn the ship, he cried as he paddled away. Destroy the ratty rats. But the sailors did not burn the ship. Back on the ship, the rats and the sailors were making peace. They agreed to sail together to the new land. Together they managed the sails and rope. Together they sailed across the sea. Good job. Goodbye, friends.